Do you like to travel? Do you hate having to find SIM cards in every country that you travel to? Well, I might have a solution for you. Hi, my name is Rebecca Meyer. And if you're new to this channel, first let me begin by welcoming you. If you're interested in tech and gizmos and gadgets and things like that, then make sure you hit that subscribe button and don't forget to ring that bell. I recently visited Thailand and China, and while in Thailand, um, I discovered it took me quite a number of days to actually be able to find a SIM card. So for this coming year, I wanted to come up with a solution that would be a little bit faster for me. I was reading online about some hotspots that I might be able to use uh, worldwide, and I figured that would be a better solution for me than using a SIM card. I found getting SIM cards in multiple countries to be very difficult so I wanted to come up with an easier solution to uh, keeping communication with my friends and family so I discovered something called Skyroam and what this is is a global Wi-Fi hotspot so essentially I no longer need to use SIM cards in each individual country what I can do is just keep my phone on airplane mode and then turn on the Wi-Fi and as I visit each individual country it will automatically recognize which country it is and allow me to have uh, Wi-Fi access. That means I can make phone calls by using WhatsApp or Facebook. I also have access to my emails and texts and things like that. So having Wi-Fi while traveling and not having to worry about SIM cards is a, is a really fantastic idea. The way Skyroam works is it gets data from different cell phone towers. Uh, so you have unlimited data, which is fantastic. Now, after a certain amount of uh, megabytes, it does actually down throttle you, but I didn't find that to be uh, a, a sad or difficult thing. Not only do you get unlimited data, but you can also connect up to five different uh, devices to it. So say it's a whole family going, then, you know, everyone in the family can actually connect to the, to the device, which is awesome. What makes this so great is that there's no contracts and you don't have to deal with uh, finding the time to set things up. I do actually really enjoy going on vacations uh, with tour guides. So if you've ever been on a, on a guided tour, then you'll know that you know things go really, really, really fast and you uh, sort of have to keep up with it. Sometimes there's not a whole lot of time to actually go shopping for SIM cards or phones or things like that when you're in, a, in another country. So being able to use something like Skyroam is really great because uh, you'll you land in a country or, or get to another location, open up the Skyroam, and then there you go, you've got Wi-Fi immediately. Now this is the original Skyroam. It, um, I mean, the build quality is all right. It is a little on the plasticky side, but I'll be honest with you, I don't really care. What I care about is the fact that I can just, uh, you know, push a button and get connected and it's it's super easy to use if you do end up getting this i do recommend turning it on and updating the firmware prior to uh, leaving to whatever country you're going to uh, just to make sure everything's up to date on here when you purchase it it does come preloaded with three days which is great i always tend to buy a, a couple of extra you know just to be on the safe side but i do really really like this um, i think it's fantastic now recently Skyroam has come up with a new device. This is the Skyroam Solus. Now on the original device there were lots of little buttons and lots of little things that you had to uh, sort of figure out in order to use. But what makes uh, this one so great is um, all you have to do is just push one button and you are good to go and it, it does all the work for you which is fantastic. Um, this also does 4G and LTE and um, yeah you really can't beat that. When this Solus first came out, I had contacted uh, Skyroam and I said, well, why would I want this instead of this? And uh, they informed me that this is actually a portable battery um, pack as well. So this is great. And uh, I think to have traveling is fantastic. This one has about eight hours of work time. This one has about 16. Apparently it even has a battery uh, somewhat similar to what Tesla uses. So, I mean, that's really, really cool. Uh, so this is, this is uh, definitely the way to go for the future, no doubt. 
Now, as far as my experience with Skyroam, I was able to actually use it when I landed in Bogota when I was on my way to Peru and uh, just fired it up. It worked immediately. I was able to let my family know that I was halfway on my journey to my destination, which was Peru, Cusco, Peru. And, uh, and that was great. Once I got to Cusco, Peru, same thing, just powered it back up and it immediately knew that I was in Peru. It's able to, to understand that it's in a different country immediately so there's not much that you need to do so for traveling it's absolutely fantastic now on a side note I recently went through Hurricane Irma um, for those of you who don't know it was a massive hurricane that covered uh, more than the state of Florida it was a quite a large hurricane with that hurricane came a lot of uh, power outages over 16 million people were without power and uh, in addition to not having power, we didn't have things like cable, internet, and phone use. So I thought I would give my Skyrim a shot, and you know what? I don't know why it worked, because most of the cell towers were down. Um, it does connect to different cell towers, so perhaps the one that I usually use wasn't able to work. Um, maybe it connected to a different cell tower. I'll be honest with you, I have no idea how it worked. But at the end of the day, it worked. Um, and so through that, even though I was in my house, even though my phone said no service, clicked on Skyroam, made some phone calls with WhatsApp, and, uh, and I was good to go and uh, keep in contact with my, um, my work and my family. So it was, man, it was a lifesaver. And I, I'm thrilled that I own it. Um, you do actually have a couple of options. If you want to own it, fantastic. It does come preloaded with a few days. Your other option is if you're not much of a traveler, you don't think you're going to use it that much, you can actually rent it. So you do have options there. You know, maybe you want to give it a shot before you, before you dive in and then you have that option. But overall, I just want to say that Skyrim is something that I absolutely love having in my bag. Um, and especially with the new update with the uh, Skyrim Solus, uh, with the uh, battery pack, with 16 hours of usage time, I mean, this is fantastic. With the older model, I did make sure that I would uh, turn it off just to conserve battery power. But um, I'm super excited to use this in some of my upcoming trips, and, uh, and we'll see how it goes there. As far as whether or not you should get Skyrim, I mean, I think this thing is absolutely fantastic. Uh, the updated version is great because it does hold 16 hours of usage time. I mean, that's fantastic. Again, you can do uh, up to five devices on both. This one does have 4G LTE, and um, it's, uh, it's, it's absolutely fantastic. I would not go to any other country with out these just to know that you have good Wi-Fi access if you've ever used Wi-Fi in hotels and things like that then you'll know it's it's not so good when I use this one in Peru uh, I was actually able to upload YouTube videos I did actually upload a, a 4k YouTube video although it did take a little bit longer I'm not sure uh, I'm not sure why it worked but it did I don't think it's supposed to be like that uh, good on data heavy stuff but it worked for me so i think that's fantastic and uh yeah i would give this a rating as an a plus plus i think this is a great device i'd like to thank you all for stopping by and if you're interested in seeing more content like this just make sure you hit that subscribe button and we'll see you soon